Question 13A in a practical examination, Neri recorded the volume V of water as 6.4 liters, correct to one decimal place. Complete the statement in the answer space below. So, if you see this one is trying to assess our understanding of decimal numbers and rounding off. So, if the volume V is recorded to be 6.4 liters, we need to look for which numbers when expressed to one decimal place would do give us 6.4. So the range will give it to two decimal places such that this value will fall within that range. So the lowest number in such a way that when you round it to one decimal place to give us 6.4 should be 6.35. If I look at 6.34, you'll notice that if I round this one to one decimal place, it will become 6.3 because this 4 is less than 5. If it's above 5 or equal, we add 1 to the next decimal place, which is the case for this one because this is 5 or if it was 6, 7 or the way up to 9 this will become 6.4 so the lowest value that 6.4 liters can be to two decimal places is 6.35 then the other side what is the maximum value this one can take in such a way that when you round it off to one decimal place it does not go beyond 6.4 so this would be something like 6.44 because the moment it becomes 6.45 because this is 5 or above we add a 1 on this one so it becomes 6.5 so if this is 6 or the way up to 9 if that's the case this will not hold but if this value the second decimal place is between 0 to 4. Rounding off, we are adding a 0 to this 4. So the volume should lie between 6.35 and 6.44. And these are liters. So I can maybe just say liters, liters. So once you do that, you are good to go. Question B The actual length of the longest side of a rectangular playing field is in. 102 meters. A boy measured the same side as 99.8 meters. Calculate the relative error. So we are looking for the relative error in this case. So how do we find the relative error? So the formula for the relative error is given by measured value mv minus the actual value over the actual value. So in this case, what is the measured value? The measured value is the one that the student obtains, which is this one, 99.8 meters. What is the actual value? The actual value is this one, which is 102. So once you have this thing just to replace, let me just substitute now. We are going to have 99. 0.8 minus 102 over 102. So this is going to give me 99.8 minus 102. It will give me negative 2.2. But now, because this value should be an absolute value, the difference should be an absolute value. Something that I need to emphasize. This should be an absolute value. So meaning whether it's negative or positive, we take it as a positive number. So this will give me 2.2 over 102. Then afterward, we simplify this to the lowest O number. So the first thing that we do is 2.2, because of space, I'll, I'll close this one, but in an exam, don't close this one. Multiply by 10, so that it becomes 22. We are getting rid of decimal places. The same thing that we do down, we do it on top. 102 times 10. Relative error is equal to 
So I have 2.2 multiplied by 10 over 102 multiplied by 10. 2.2 times 10, it will give me 22 over 1020, which is 1020. Then at this point, you just we divide by the lowest number. 2 into 22 is 11. 2 into 10 is a 5, remainder 0. 2 into 2 is a 1, remainder 0. 2 into 0, that one is a 10. So, is there a number that can go into 51 and 11? 11 can go in, cannot go into 51 without leaving a remainder. So, this is the relative error. So, we have 11 over 5, 10. Once you do that, you are good to go. You get these four marks. So, if you haven't downloaded our apps, please check on the links below on the description section. You find a lot of resources that will be up to you. You can also get them from the Google Play Store.